The NBA season is going to start tonight, so I kind of wanted to go over some of the bets, the things that you probably should be end up taking in this first week. Obviously, there isn't a lot of data down for this season because it is the first week. Preseason, some of the guys played, but, you know, they don't play for the whole game, so you can't really get a good idea of what's going to happen. You just kind of have to go off stats from former game ones in previous years. Um, and that's why let's pretty much just get into what you should take um, for this first game, the Lakers versus Nuggets, the literally first game of the NBA season. Um starting at 7.30 Eastern time. And, you know, for this one, LeBron, in his, um, like, first games of the regular season, usually ends up losing, even when he has really good teams, even when he has championship teams. So if you're looking to take a money line today, um, you're going to want to go with Denver money line. Um, I would stay away from the spread, I would definitely stay away from the spread. Um, uh, I do like the over in points, though. I do like the over in points. Then we can go to... the point breakdowns here. And if we go to the 15.1s, uh, kind of a good pick here. And a guy that really did this a lot of the time, Austin Reeves at 15 points. He had a lot of, especially towards the end of that season, 15-point games. Um, I think he might go for 20 in this. That's a bit sketchy to take that. I think 15 should be just fine. I wouldn't be worried about that. 15 points for him. Um, going to the 20-point range is the good spot to take Jamal Murray. Jamal Murray, I think he's going to, you know, make a lot of shots in this game. Um, High-scoring guy against the Lakers. Put up, I think, a 40-point game in the playoffs against the Lakers. I like him to score at least 20. If you're really trying to take risks, you could go for the 25 to 30. Um, 25 points, this is where you take Jokic right here. Um, I wouldn't be mad if. Uh, I wouldn't like if you took him at 30 points. If you even wanted to do something crazy and put him, take him at 40, it's very possible he could get there in this game. But I think the safest bet, if you're trying, if you're trying to lock it up, would be this 25 points. He's going to hit that. That's not even really a debate at all. Um. Now, when we get to the threes, when we get to the the breakdown of that. Um, I like LeBron to make two threes. He had a lot in the preseason, but I think he can get two in this game. Um, I like Jamal Murray to make actually three threes in this game. Really like that. Shoots a lot of threes. I expect him to make at least three against the Lakers. Um, and then Austin Reeves made a lot of threes in the postseason. I think it's a pretty safe bet to say that he makes at least two in this game. Double-double. I wouldn't even bet on that because the odds aren't good enough. Um, but we want to go down here to Jokic rebounds. And we want to take his over. This is a slam dunk to pick, uh, to hit. Uh, I see no way where this doesn't hit at all. I think that's it for this game. Um, So pretty much what you got. You could, if you're feeling crazy enough, you could parlay this. I personally wouldn't if I were you. But if you're feeling crazy, you could parlay this. Most likely what you should be doing is you should be individually betting these or parlaying some of them together, ones that would make sense. Um, but, yeah, we got Denver money line. We have the over of 28.5. Austin Reeves, more than 15 points. Jamal Murray, more than 20 points. Jokic, over 25. That should be easy. LeBron, two made threes. I really have faith that that will happen. Jamal Murray should make three threes. 
Austin Reeve, two plus threes, and then Jokic over 12.5 rebounds is essentially free. And I like it. And then if you are looking for one more that's really crazy, um, I'm not seeing it on here, but um, Jokic to do a triple-double. It might be somewhere down here. But a Jokic triple-double is definitely in the – yeah. So his odds of that are he's at plus 135 to uh, record a triple-double. If you're feeling crazy – uh, I don't mind that. That definitely could happen. Definitely a possibility. But uh, I'm going to stay away from it on the main one. But as you can see right underneath me is the main kind of breakdown on what you should do. If you're feeling risky, you could parlay that together. But most likely what I would do is I would just individually bet those or I would um, put together ones that make good sense like the the Denver money line, the Jokic 25, and the Jokic rebounds would be a good one to put together. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much what we got for this first game of the year.